Welcome back to another GBA YT Wild Rift video. Today is going to be another League of Legends tutorial um, so we can get those people that have never played League of Legends and, and help them out um, so they help understand the champions that they're going to be playing in Wild Rift. Um, I think these are beneficial. Um, I think it's going to be more beneficial when the game actually comes out. Um, so we will do these again whenever Wild Rift does come out. Today we're going to be going over Blitzcrank. Um, he's infamous for the hook. Infamous for the hook. Um, infamous. Um, so let's read over his uh, passive. Blitzcrank's mana barrier can activate once every 90 seconds when he falls below 20% health. This creates a mana shield equal to 30% of his maximum mana that lasts up to 10 seconds. Um, so pretty much, yeah, he gets a he gets a nice little you know nice little shield um, equal to 30% of his maximum mana that lasts up to 10 seconds. Um, definitely super helpful in fights. Um, you'll see it come up usually. It's when you know it'll come like when he gets there. It'll get shield up to there. Um, his Q is going to be his crank, which is he's infamous for. Everyone knows him as, you know, everyone knows that he cranks. Um, so let's read it. Brother Crank fires his right hand. If he encounters an enemy unit, it will stun them and deal 270 magic damage while he pulls them to himself. Um, so he, when he cranks, he cranks you to him. Um, which is very useful, but then he also has his, we'll go over his two first. Blitzcrank supercharges himself, gaining 90% movement speed and 62% attack speed for 5 seconds. The movement speed bonus the movement speed bonus decays over the duration. When overdrive ends, Blitzcrank's movement speed is delayed by 30 seconds for 1.5 seconds. Um, so let's show you here. That's right here, he gets super fast, and then after you'll see, there's a noise effect. He'll get really slow. Yeah, and it's hard to move. Um, so this is used, he, he's obviously a support main. Um, so he supports the AD carry. Um, this is used, you know, it really is useful if you're like you're here and then you want to get ash, you know? So you just charge it like this and you come out of the bush real quick. And you have to get away from the minions, you know, you pour and you knock her up. Um, that's his next ability. Next ability is Blitzcrank charges up his fist to make his next attack deal double his to <laughs> Sorry, one of the one of the cats stepped on the, the keyboard and shut the keyboard off, so it cut the recording in the middle, but it's okay. Um, his next attack is going to be his E. Uh, Blitzcrank charges up his fist to make his next attack deal double his total attack damage as physical damage and pop his target up in the air. Um, so if you can imagine, um, you know, it's, it's, if you hit one of these cranks pretty much after level one or two. Um, it's definitely going to be an automatic kill. Pretty much, it should be with the AD carry. So you know you're going to come with speedy. Um, you know, you're going to crank and miss the crank. Um, you know, things like that. And then it gets really slow. <laughs> we'll hit it again here, just to show you the combo, the wham bam combo. And then you knock up, and then you can punch really hard. Um, then it's all. So it's all. It's gonna be an area effect. Area effect. Um, area of effect ability. Uh, pass up. While the spell is available, lightning charges blitzes fists, marking enemies. After one second, they are shocked for 150 second or 150 magic damage. This stacks up to three times. Active destroys damage shields on nearby enemies. Deals 500 magic damage and silences for 0.75 seconds. Um, so it's super effective in team fights, especially late in the game. Um, you know, you hit a crank and they all dive you. You know, you're gonna want to all. Um, yeah, it's really effective um, for multiple, multiple people. Um, and also his crank, you can hit anything. You can crank anything. So you know, bang, you can crank that. Um, a lot of people you'll see before the game, they crank this um, through this wall. Um, that's a pretty pretty infamous crank at, at, at mid elos, mid to high elos. So his crank can actually hit through this wall. Um, let's see if we can do it. And then you can always check out another cat just went across the keyboard. Okay. Um, let's crank here. Okay. And that's really annoying as a jungle. It's super annoying. Um, you know, that really puts you behind. Um, so there's a lot of things you can do with him, really. Um, let's see where Ash is. She should be coming back. So hyperdrive. You know, can you always knock up first? And then when the enemy runs away, say they run away. Bang. Right. Um, there's a lot of things you can do with him. Um, but yeah, he gets caught out a lot. If you use your W and you speed up, and then you um, get slowed. Like I said, I'm speeding up to go catch somebody here. And then I get slow. Like... Right now, I'm very, oh, very vulnerable. You know, I can't really move. Um, and if you know, especially if the sport has a stun or a slow, um, it's really, uh, really tough. Uh, but a lot of the times, you want to. A lot of the times, you want to keep people under the tower. Um, that's a huge thing. Let me turn these things off. There's so many of them. 
Um, so you want to queue, to queue, you know, enemies under tower. Like they will be super low health, and then all you gotta do is hit that crank. You know, you can even step out to like here because you're still in tower range. You know, so that's when you want to bang. You want to hit that queue. Um, super, super effective. Uh, a lot of people ban him just because he's, you know, if there's a good blitz crank, then um yeah it's troublesome um and a lot of them will pay attention to you know highly elos a lot of them will pay attention to you know which way you usually juke say it's left or right um and they'll crank so like say you're like right here say you're like right there um and then you usually move here they'll literally crank there instead of here like because they know you're going to try to dodge it um, you know, as soon as they see that crank, um, they're gonna try to, they're, you know, they're gonna move. So here's Ash, um, you know, like I said, you can always knock up first, you can speed, knock up, and say they're running away, you know, you can always hit them with a Q. I don't know what that was. We won't even use the flash, we'll just play with her. Oh my, I'm gonna have to flash all. <laughs> Obviously, I, I haven't. I don't play. I don't play support. Oh, my, another cat just went across the keyboard. Now I don't know what this red circle is outside the the thing. I don't know if it's. it's I'm sure it's gonna show it. Uh, but yeah, so that's Blitz Crank for you. Um, he's definitely a, a you know popular support because um, he's easier to play. Um, there's definitely. You know, higher, higher skilled blitz cranks. Um, but you know, as long as you hit that crank and then you hit the, you know, hit the crank, hit the E for the knockup. I swear I was, uh, cause it's an allied one. Enemy target to me. Um, so yeah, so if, as long as you, this is, so as long as you hit the crank and then the knockup, um, that's a lot of, that's a lot of damage right there. And it also, I mean, you know, they're, they can't do anything for however long that is, uh, the crank and the knockup. Um, so, yeah, he's gonna be a popular support in Wild Rift, no doubt. Um, so all you wanna do is pretty much wait for him to dodge his Q. If he's close to you, you just wanna auto, auto, auto. Um, you, you might wanna use an ability or, or two, but, um, really you just, anytime he gets close to you, you wanna auto. And then once he uses his Q, he is useless. So you really wanna go after him. Um, you know, you really, really, really wanna, oh, you know, take advantage of when he doesn't have his Q. Um, because he's, he's really as useless. I mean, he can knock you out, but, you know, still, he's, you know, just, you know, has no reach unless he's right next to you. Um, but, you know, you'll see a lot of flash cues. Um, definitely. I don't know if I can hit the flash cue. <laughs> I'm playing on 200. Hey, Oops. No My flash isn't up. Um, let me auto refresh everything. Alright, yeah, so you can hit the flash cue if you want. Oops, I missed. <laughs> it's not it's not easy, but oops I missed. <laughs> there we go. Um you know there's a lot of cool things you can do with him. Um but yeah, hopefully this guy's uh hopefully this video helped you guys out. Um I hope you enjoyed and we're gonna have a new champion tomorrow. Comment below and let me know which champion you'd like to watch. Um we'll be giving a breakdown of everyone that's been confirmed for Wild Rift just to give everyone that has never played Lego Legends PC a chance to learn the champions. Um you know really in depth from all the abilities and all the skills. Um so yeah. Um, definitely guys I appreciate your support and I appreciate you watching drop a drop a like drop a sub um, if you enjoyed the video and you, you want to see more video content uh, put those notifications on so you get notifications every time a new video comes out all right guys thank you so much I appreciate you supporting the channel um, take care hope you guys have a wonderful day and I'll see you tomorrow take care guys bye